Today, we will be taking a look at the best workout headphones you can buy on Amazon today. So, if you're looking for the best workout headphones for your workout sessions, we got you covered. And as usual, we have the links to all the headphones mentioned in this video in the description below. And make sure you like and subscribe for more videos like this. Now, let's go straight to the video. Number five, RHA True Connect. The RHA True Connect looks quite like Apple AirPods and aren't a million miles away in terms of comfort. However, they go into your ear rather than sitting just outside and have sweatproofing for all of your run, cycle, or gym needs. What you end up with is a pair of running headphones that sound at least as good as the Bose SoundSport Free, but look less peculiar and are not as susceptible to wind noise. There's a lack of overt bass, but I've found there's enough to keep you motivated whilst listening to Techno Workout Playlist 57 and mid-range and treble sparkle more than on the Jabra's. One way, these $130 AirPods alikes are not like actual AirPods is that pairing is very occasionally a bit clunky. If you return them to the case and try again, it tends to work the second time. The case itself is a bit fiddly too, but again, not enough to make the True Connect lose my love. Fit is obviously important with True Wireless, and the RHAs are excellent in this respect because they come with about 15 billion choices of ear tips. They don't feel as super secure as the Jabra Buds, but the flip side of that is that they're a little more comfortable. In the gym, they're perfect. Although on the road, you may find yourself at times nervously prodding them back into your ear holes as you pound potholed roads. Overall, these fall short of Jabra's superb workout buds, but many punters will prefer their less intrusive fit and more musical audio. If the price starts to slide down below the Elite 65T, they'll become more attractive indeed. Number 4. Soundcore Spirit Sports by Anchor The first two options here are at least somewhat high-end and tailored for those who value good audio quality. The Anchor Soundcore Spirit Sports are a bit scrappier in the musical department, but easily as good when it comes to running and workout essentials such as sweatproofing, secure but comfy fit, and solid battery life and they can be had for less than 30 quid. What can you get for 30 quid nowadays? <laughs> Practically nothing. The killer features here, besides a value for money, are the excellent fit, at least in my ears, although a variety of ear tips mean they should work for most people, and the fact that they're not just sweatproof, but actually submersible in seawater. There is no little cover over the USB charging socket, as on most such headphones, because the socket itself is water resistant. Now, personally, I would not advise going swimming in the sea because they will eventually corrode, but this level of protection does inspire confidence they will survive multiple sweaty workouts. I've had supposedly gym-friendly headphones literally explode because sweat got into the charging port, so I know of what I speak here. Sound quality-wise, these are nowhere near as good as the Optima New Force Buds, nor are they as high-tech as the Jabra ones. However, at this price, you might well shrug and ask, eh, who cares? Number 3. Optima New Force BE Sport 4 The BE Sport 4 headphones takes a T3 award-winning BE Sport 3, which previously topped this chart since about 1987, and improves it in several ways 
whilst maintaining the sub $90 price tag. And so, naturally enough, it's our top rated non-true wireless wireless headphones for workouts and running. These in-ear sports headphones with ear-hugging hooks are the best headphones for exercise that you can get at their price point. The only caveat I'd add to this is personally, I'd advise spending more and going true wireless with the Jabra Elite Active 65T. But then, I'm a big ticket guy. That aside, the BE Sport 4 is great. Easily good enough to use as day-to-day -day headphones thanks to the fantastic clarity, support for both AAC and aptX, giving improved audio quality on Apple and Android devices respectively, well-deployed bass and 10-hour battery life, up from 8 on the previous model. They also offer very secure yet comfortable fit. Downsides? If you prefer to be able to hear the world around you whilst exercising, I don't. These might not be to your liking because their noise isolation is very good. See further down this buying guide for some headphones that let more sound filter in. The choice of tips includes different size buds, so you don't have to use a slightly horrific looking double penetrator pictured above. And in-ear hooks, which strike just the right balance of very good anchoring without sacrificing comfort. The price is very reasonable given the quality of the Optima New Force BE Sport 4. If you aren't ready to embrace true wireless, they're the best headphones for running and gym that you can get, and also a pair of headphones you can happily use while doing nothing strenuous at all. Number 2. Jabra Elite Active 65T If you're after a great true wireless headphones for running but can't stretch to Powerbeats Pro, Jabra's Elite Active 65T is your new workout bud. It's also great for gym workouts, cross training, cycling, spinning, rope thrashing, and anything else where you get sweaty. Since I started using them, I would now not willingly go back to even the most minimally wired Bluetooth headphones. For workout purposes, the 65T sound great. At launch, they sounded a bit off, but Jabra has honed the sound with seemingly never-ending sequence of software updates since then. They're sufficiently bassy, great at pounding, workout-friendly music, and have a reasonable amount of musicality too. I've used them many times as headphones outside of the gym or the run environment. There is actually an accelerometer in these for counting reps and working in conjunction with Jabra's own fitness app. I don't recommend that. Get a running gym watch instead, but some people might find it useful. It's the comfortable yet unshakable fit and complete absence of wires that make the Jabra Elite 65T so essential for workouts. Once you've tried true wireless, it's very hard to go back to having that wire joining your buds, snagging on your neck or running vest. One last note, this model, the Elite Active 65T, has a special coating so it sticks in the ear a little better. Jabra's other model, the Elite 65T, lacks that coating. There's also no accelerometer, but I'm not too bothered about that. As such, that's less recommendable if you work out outdoors, where there's a risk of them falling out and being lost forever, as in fact happened to me. It's otherwise a similarly excellent true wireless earbud. Number 1. Beats by Dr. Dre Power Beats Pro. You can't beat these beats. They share a name and, superficially, an appearance with previous Power Beats buds, but these true wireless powerhouses absolutely crush their predecessors when it comes to quality of sound and security of fit. The only downside I can think of to Powerbeats Pro is that the battery case is considerably larger than most rivals. However, 
with nine hours of life per charge and the ability to give them a charge that lasts a few hours by plugging them in for just a few minutes, the case is a less essential item than it is with other true wireless earbuds. For sheer sound quality and the way they are all but impossible to accidentally dislodge from your ears, Powerbeats Pro are the gold standard of wireless earbuds for gym and running. Buy some would be my advice. Thanks for watching.